Have you had balut before? Yes, I have. <laughs> Chicken soup, duck soup, it's right? It's delicious. What do you like about balut? It's unique, it's different, and it's Philippine culture. Oh. Woo! <laughs> Welcome to the Philippines Fest in Brooklyn, New York. This is your first time having balut. It is. It's not that bad. It's very good it's actually. Not bad it's just at all. like chicken soup. Hey! See? <laughs> it's not that bad. It tastes good. Yeah. It looks like eggs and eyeballs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Here, sir. I'm having blue here today. Good. Yes, how, sir. How is it? It's good. I like it. Nice with the vinegar, the salt. Is this your first time having balut? Yeah, it's my first time having balut. Nice. And you know what balut is now? Yes, I do know what balut is. <laughs> it's, it's a duck egg. It's a duck egg. Can you show me where the duck is? Oh, the duck is right here. <laughs> this embryo right here. The embryo is the yellow part. All right. Enjoy. All right. Thank, thank you. you. Are you drinking all the soup? And how is it? Really it's like chicken <laughs> chicken soup, duck soup, right? It's delicious. Right. It's your first time to have balloon. Very good. You're very adventurous. We're trying. We're trying. It's, it's really good actually. Oh, there, uh, there you go. <laughs> there it is. Drink yeah, the entire soup. Alright, we yeah, drink the soup. Drink right. The soup. right. <laughs> and then uh, once you drink everything. Drink soup. Right. Ready? Ready? Nice, yay! Oh yeah, that's really that's good. good. Wow, very good. You're a, you're a legit Filipino now. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. We feel really welcome now. <laughs> hey, what do you have here? Uh, balut. Balut. Have you had balut before? Yes, I have. Nice, yeah. nice. Yeah, we've been waiting for hours for this. Like we've been just circling around for like almost what two and a half hours. Waiting for them to restock. Oh, wait, do you, have you had balut before? Yes, I, I, I live in the Philippines. All right. But I'm visiting my grandkids. Nice. What What do you like about balut? It's unique. It's different, and it's Philippine culture. And what's your favorite Filipino food? Oh my God, everything. Every, now you're craving for balut. Well, when I left, before I left, I had to go white party, so I ate it before I left. But nice. you have to. When you're gonna go to the Philippines, and you're gonna try different foods. And if you're going to go to the tourist places like Manila and stuff like that, then you're not exploring the Philippines. If you go to the province, then you're really exploring. It's, it's a different world. You, you right. know what? It's more better, it's more healthier. And you enjoy it. It's, you enjoy it. It's, it's just a better life. Awesome. All anyway, right. It's a pleasure to meet you and Same all the best in your family. Hi. Hi, guys. I'm Rach from Patak by Rach. Right. Welcome. <laughs> What's your specialty here? That would be the lechon belly over there. So what made you choose lechon? Um, it's actually um, like an homage for my dad. Uh, nice. It's his recipe. Nice. So when when we first started this, he was the one that helped me develop the recipe. Right. So yeah, we just stuck by it. So you started as a um, pop up, and yes. now you have a restaurant. Yes, yes, we do. Thank you so Where's much. Where's your restaurant now? It's in Upper Manhattan, two fifteen and Broadway, and then wow. so we're by Inwood area. Congratulations! Thank That's you. nice. Thank you so much. And what Such are you? A milestone. Yes, exactly. What are you having? What are you cooking here now? So we have a couple of things in our menu that are new for this year. We have four things that's always been there, which is the sisi croquette, the chan croquette, the lumpia, and some chicharon. Now we added some lempo, bulaklak, and some lechon kawala. Um, we want to make sure it's crispy, guys. We we know we know how important it is. For this, you know. <laughs> Filipinos are very particular with the skin, yes. so it has to be perfect. Exactly. We don't we don't fool around with that. Why Patok by Rage? That's a very cool, catchy name. <laughs> We've always wanted to say that we're we wanted everything on point. So Patok is a it means booming, it means prosperity. So we wanted to attract that. Yeah. <laughs> so lastly, I know um winning move ng black belter na lechon. I know. Pork chop! <laughs> <laughs> I knew it though. I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> what are you having here? This is liempo over rice. Liempo over rice. Over rice. Liempo. Nice. From Patok by Rich, right? I think so. <laughs> I think so. You like it? It's good. Very it's good. Yummy. Okay. Take care. Thanks. Youngest boy George! <laughs> What's up? What's up, New Yorker? How are you? 
Oh my God, this oh my is God. the soup um, for the La Paz Batshoy. La Paz Batshoy. Would you think that the signature dish for Ilo Ilo, Ilo, Ilo is Batshoy, right? Absolutely. For those yes. who don't know it, what's Batshoy? Uh, so La Paz Batshoy was originated in a La Paz market in La Paz district of Iloilo Ilo City. Uh, my family, we used to sell a La Paz Batshoy in a supermarket back in the day, so it's still the, the same recipe. So you're so yeah, it's it's, it's a legit. it's a longo dish. So you're this, yes, a, this it is. is real legit Filipino elongo dish. That's right. Nice, nice, <laughs> nice. Very good. Oh, then this is one of their signature dishes. When you say elongo, bachoy, bachoy is the yeah. signature dish. That's right. Nice, nice. Bachoy, everybody. Hi, boy George in a sal. What what's boy, behind the name? Bo why boy George? It's because like me and my friends we call everyone George. So <laughs> it's just like you know what I'm gonna name my business boy George. <laughs> and one of your best products is in bacolod in a sal. What makes bacolod in a chicken in a sal so special? What makes it so special? I guess like the flavor profile of chicken in a sal is unique. Um, like if you think of the Philippines, bacolod is right in the middle in the Visayan region. So that means it's an island. If you taste the inner sal, you taste the, the, the lemongrass, the vinegar, a little bit sweet. It feels like you're in an island. Nice, so nice. For me, that's the, that's the, the chicken inner sal. It's unique because of the flavor profile. What are you having here? Inner sal. sal from Boy George, right? Boy George, the best. Nice. And you? How's the bachoy? How's the bachoy? The best. Have you had bachoy before? Yeah, Iloilo. Uh, oh, Iloilo. Yeah. Are you from Iloilo? Yeah. Does it taste like uh, Ilongo Bachoy? Yeah, from La Paz Bachoy. La Paz Bachoy. Yeah. Nice. Authentic. Authentic. Very nice. Hi, what do you have here? I have La Paz Bachoy. La Paz Bachoy. Nice. Very good. Very so good. It reminds Very me good. of home. Labang mag-apply dyan. Mag-chat-chat. Gusto mo mag-training mag-chat? Pwede. Kailangan ko may taga-chap. Chopper. Kailangan, buo pa rin yung daliri mo. <laughs> How long does it take for them to cook the lechon? It, it's gonna be like 3 to 4 hours. Wow. Yes. Wow. And how many lechons can you finish in a day? Um, 6 to 8, something like that. 6 to 8 lechon in a day? Oh, wow. Nice. Congratulations. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Nice. Hey. Yay, Yay! What do you have here? Lechon sisig nachos. Nice, the and you? Over rice. Yeah. Over rice. Yeah. And it's with sisig first. and lechon over rice. This is your first this Filipino first lechon. Yeah, it is. Yeah. But you have other Filipino food before. Nope, this is the first. Oh, one. nice, nice. Start, yeah. How how is it? Phenomenal. <laughs> <laughs> he loves it. Yeah. Are you gonna have some more Filipino food next time? Oh yeah. I'll make nice. sure of it. <laughs> and this is a nice. Um, rendition of yeah, nachos, different. right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, very good. All right, enjoy. Yeah. Hi, how are you? Uh, what do you have here? Um, the lechon from Lechon Bay. Lechon Bay. Yeah. And, and bulaklak. bulaklak. The lechon bulaklak. Yeah. Right. How, how is it? It's so good. It's so delicious. Yummy. Right, it's very crispy. The lechon yeah. skin's very good. Yeah. And do you think Filipino food is still underrated? or unappreciated, underappreciated now? Or do you think it's more mainstream? Um, definitely underrated. I don't think mainstream at all. Um, right. I don't really see that much. But hopefully with this yeah. event, it's gonna be more popular. Yeah, hopefully. Definitely. Hopefully it'll be two more streets. Right, yeah. right, right. Where are you guys from? Philippines. Philippines, nice. Oh. Pinoy, Pinoy. Saan sa Pilipinas? Batangas po, in Talabang. Batangas, nice. Ready for video. Hi. Hi. How are you? Good. The name of your store? In Sachibog. In Sachibog. In Show my love. Thank, Thank you. you. And what's behind you? Lumpia with a heart. <laughs> and how about that one? I want to roll you. <laughs> Plantains, which I Plantains, and this one? Both of them are pork. Both of them are pork, and that one's plantains? Yes. Thank you. Hey, what do you have here? Oh, sorry. I have lumpia. Just regular. 
Lumpia Shanghai. Right. Yes. <laughs> and are you excited to eat it? Yes. Oh my gosh. I'm going to share it with my friends over there. Nice, We're so nice. excited. Here we have Shou Mai. Uh, it's his favorite food. food. <laughs> have you had Filipino food before? I have. Yeah. Nice. He's made a whole bunch for me. Oh, nice. What's your favorite Filipino food? Um, probably sinigang, sinigang. or adobo because it's so classic. <laughs> <Of course. laughs> yeah. Oh, so you have, what do you have here? I have some shomai. You have a lot of shomai. I do. It looks like that's one of your favorites. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> nice. And you like it spicy, and the other one not too spicy. Well, this one is for my sister, and oh. this one is mine. As you can see, a lot of chili oil. Very nice. <laughs> Okay, enjoy! Thank you! Uh, Beautiful, thank you so much. Yes. What do you have here? I have a shamai. Right, have you had Filipino food before? It's been a little while. It's been a little while. Yeah. And what do you think of Filipino food? What do you say about Filipino food? Delicious. Do you think Filipino food is underrated? Absolutely. It is? Uh, <laughs> but totally. it's becoming mainstream now. I hope so. Uh, Alright. I'm ready to eat these. Enjoy! Thank you. Uh, what do you have here? Okay, I have the sweet lumpia. I think it's Tehran. Nice. Uh, I've only ever had the ones with pork in it, so I'm very excited. That's a dessert that's sweet. Thank and you. I think there's banana and what else is in there? Jackfruit. Banana oh. and jackfruit. So I think you'll like it. Oh yeah, I'm excited. All right, enjoy. Thank you. <laughs> lumpia. Yeah. Have that's you had delicious. lumpia before? Never no, before. It's no, it's, so that's, that's one of the more popular Filipino food. <laughs> It's, uh, and the, this one, what is this? The ube. This is the ube, CEO of ube. So it's like a croissant donut. Nice. Um, nice. It looks great. Yeah. And we're excited. Is this the first time to have Filipino food? I think so. My, my, my is big. Nice, nice. You I'm should, loving it. I love it. Oh, try some more. There's like lechon, mm. the chicken in the sal, and a lot more. Uh, thanks for the recommendation. Ruben. All right, Thank enjoy. You. Thank you. Oh, Hi. What do you have here? It's ube fountain. Oh, ube fountain. Yes. Yeah. Oh, nice, nice. So this is the toppings for our ube cake. So we make um, ube cake with ube butter, and then this is the toppings for it. Nice. Very nice. It looks yummy. <laughs> All right. Thank you. What's the name of your store? It's Katamis. Katamis. And Katamis is what does Katamis mean? Um, very sweet. Nice. Yes. Nice. But just like all your products here, they're very sweet. Uh, ube butter, chocolate butter, and matcha butter, and then ube ganache, matcha ganache, and choco ganache. So this is our, the spread of cakes, and then we have the toppings for the chocolate over there. Very nice, congratulations! Alright, bye bye! Pinoy coolers, Pinoy coolers. Yeah. And what's your specialty? Uh, it's a halo halo and buko pandan. We have an ice scramble too, and we have like the ube, calamansi, mel um, melon, and then sagut gulama. Nice. Is that savory pao or? Uh, dessert pao. It's, it's sweet pao. Okay. This is Gobi's Goods. Gobi's. We have a bunch of Filipino have. inspired desserts. We have a variety uh, ranging between ube and other products. We're known for our CEO of ube right here, which is our number one seller. It's a brioche bun filled with an ube halaya pastry cream filling coated in sugar, uh, chantilly, and ube caramel shards. Nice. And what's mm. the next best seller? Uh, oh, I would have to go with. The ube roll, it's a variation of a cinnamon roll. It's a ube halaya rolled up and it's coated with a sweet coconut glaze. Is that also Absolutely. known as ensaimada or that's different? No, that's different. That's different. Mm -hmm. oh, nice, very good. Congratulations. Thank it's you, brother. Thank full, you. Sold out. Cool, yeah. thanks. What have here? This is the ube bao. Ube bao. Have you had Filipino food before? I have, but I never had ube bao before. So, what so far? What's your favorite Filipino food? Oh man, what's the corn babinga? Bibinka, yeah. those are good. Yes, there's Delicious. a weakness for that. How about you? What's yeah, your same. favorite Filipino food? We share that. Oh my gosh, nice, yeah, nice, we love nice. it. Enjoy. Oh, enjoy. Yeah. Very good, thank Go. you. This is ube sago. Sago, yeah. Nice. Do you like it? <laughs> That's pretty good. Nice, nice. nice. Ice cream alternative. For those who uh, are lactose intolerant, it's cool. Uh, yeah, it's good. It's kind of like ice cream. Oh, 
Awesome. Yeah, Thank you. Thank Enjoy. you. Where are you from? From uh, Maryland. 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 Yeah. Yeah. So you came here came just for just the Filipino for this. food. Yeah. So how long? Yeah. The quintessential Filipino dessert. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Yeah. Bye. Filipino. <laughs> <laughs> so hello. Hello. Nice. How is it? Good. Masarap. Manyaman Kenny. Manyaman Kenny. Manyaman Kenny. Hi. What do you guys have here? Okay, we have nachos, we had the ube, pork sliders, the lumpia, toron, shawai, mango, oh, sticky nice. rice. And what's and halo, the, halo, halo. And halo, halo, of course. And what's your favorite so far? Oh, ube, pork sliders. Ube, <laughs> <laughs> pork sliders. <laughs> Very nice, very nice. Have you Maybe. guys had Filipino food yeah. before? Yeah, we're all Filipino. Oh, oh, nice. Are you guys from New York? I am. Very nice. And I'm from Jersey. Jersey, Jersey, welcome. And Jersey, nice. Next month, oh, actually, next week, there's a Philippines Fest in Jersey. Really? Oh, really? Right, so it's interesting because they'll have Santa Cruzan. Enjoy. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye. -bye. Tio Paella, what's the inspiration behind the uh, Ube Paella? Oh, the Ube Paella is amazing place. It's inspiration in a purple jam from Philippines, and I make with uh, different vegetables, cauliflower, mushrooms, broccoli, and a good flavor from Tio Paella. And so far, it's a one of the best sellers in your paella, right? Yeah, it's from Miami. It's the best time in, in New York. And I try at this place. You need to try it. Nice. In Philippines, fast only. Thank you. Are you interested in getting the ube paella? Oh yeah, I want to try it. Right. Since we sell uh, ube drinks as well and ube <laughs> bibinka, we're going to try that one. It matches your shirt too? It does, yeah. Nice. <laughs> you think you're going to get uh, ube paella? No. <laughs> But it's nice to look at, right? It's yeah. very pretty. They have seafood paella too. It was delicious. I love the combination of the, the beans, the peas, the all the meats and the seafood and the flavor, the fresh rosemary and the right. It was delicious, yeah. Nice, nice. And did you see their ube paella too? I, I didn't try it, um, but I did see it for next time. Next time, right? But yeah. this one's good. Hey, what's the name of your store here? Hi, uh, name of the store is Logan & Co. NYC. Nice, and what's your specialty? Uh, we sell calamansi inspired lemonades. Nice. With and different flavors, different um, inspirations, depending on like the event that we're doing. What's the most popular one? Uh, today has been the ube and the mango. Ube. Yeah. Anything ube is popular yeah. among Filipinos. Yeah. This is this is Logan. She's the actual oh, owner. She's the actual owner of the space. That's the inspiration that's the behind inspiration. the name. Yes. Hi, Logan. Say hi. What's your favorite drink? Um, the hibiscus. The hibiscus. Nice. Very good. All right. Thank you. Thank you, brother. All right. Come see us. Oh, that's so nice. The, is, what's your favorite drink? My favorite is the ube. And tell me, that's what are so mag wheels? Mag wheels are pork intestines. And, and this is a type of bouquet I like. Uh, <laughs> and chicken intestines. Chicken intestine is the isao. Isao. Okay. Yes. Oh, nice. nice. Maraming salamat. <laughs> what do you have here? Uh, sweet food. Kik yam. Fish yam. We finished the kik yam, unfortunately. It was nice. so good. Nice. Kik yam. Masarap. 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 <laughs> <laughs> very nice, very good. Enjoy. Thank you. you know, I, do you know what you're getting? I have no idea. <laughs> yeah. So I'll tell you this is pork intestine. Okay. This is chicken intestine. And Filipino hot dog. Which is very red. <laughs> uh, that I would like. They look good. Very good. Yeah, you have the hot dog. Hot dog's good. It's not bad. All and food. all the street food. Mm -hmm. Yes. Right. <laughs> nice. And what is your favorite so far? Well, I'm Filipino, so I love everything. everything. And how about you? What's your favorite so far? Um, I like the lumpia. The lumpia. And what can you say about Filipino hot dog? You haven't tried it I yet. I haven't tried it yet. <laughs> it's, 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 uh, it's in there. Interesting it's in there. color, right? Yeah. yeah that's what I told her. It's, yeah. it's so popular back home. <laughs> that's what he was saying, so I have to try it. <laughs> the drink that you have is? She had the mango calamansi and I have just the plain calamansi. Yes, the plain calamansi. It's always nice. the better one. Very right? nice. <laughs> Alright, enjoy. Thank you. Hey. You have a nice setup here. What yeah. do you guys have? 
So syrup. So syrup. What's your favorite so far? The mag wheels. Do you know what mag wheels are? Pork yes. intestines. Pork intestines. Yes. Nice. All right. Enjoy. <laughs> Barbecue from So Syrup, right? How is it? Masarap. Masarap. Yay. Thank you. Bye -bye. What do you have here? Barbecue. Barbecue. Philippine hot dog. Barbecue and mag wheels. Are you guys from New York? Yes. yes. Queens. Queens. Nice. Enjoy. Bye -bye. All right. Salamat po. Yeah. What do you have here? Ano ni luto mo ayon? Yeto gumagawa ng mga masubi. Masubi. Technically, we have two good today, Kabisara and Japayuki. Uh, so we are mixed up uh, Filipino Japanese food. We added some silogs, which is the tocino and longanisa. <laughs> Be loaded. <laughs> I got the uh, pork lumpia musubi. This one used to be a spam musubi. <laughs> and spam. then we got long silo. Nice, that all yeah. look good. Nice, yeah. nice. Have so, you, uh, what can you say about Filipino food? It's really good. <laughs> Delicious. Grew yeah. up on it. So right. to come here today, it's, it's been awesome. Do you think Filipino food is still underrated? I think. I think it is underrated, especially because it is what you would call like cheaper cuts of meat and generally filled up with vegetables. But I think there's a certain complexity to it that's unappreciated and a lot of foreign flavors that I think a lot of people would appreciate. Right, and now it's more mainstream, I guess, right? It's becoming more mainstream. Sometimes it gets too pretty. I like it, the home style. I think that's the best way to serve it. But however, there can be more exposure to Filipino cuisine. I think it's a positive thing. All right. And for you, what's your favorite Filipino food? Anything with ube. <laughs> Anything with ube. Anything with ube. Right. Lumpia, maybe. One Lumpia day we'll have too. ube. Maybe, maybe. All right. Yeah. Enjoy. Maybe. Thank you. Something on your face. I have so much food on my face. That's okay. But to wear it is a badge of honor. It means it's delicious, yeah. right? That and I'm, I'm, I have an oh, excuse. Oh, no. Yeah, so we're okay. All right. Yeah. Thank you. The vegetable yeah. lumpia yeah. and I've got a, a pork masubi lumpia. The lumpia, how is it? It's awesome. Awesome. Hold on. Pancit. What kind of pancit is this? Veggie pancit. Oh, nice. <laughs> palabok. Yeah, of course, palabok. Of course. What makes the color of the palabok like this? This is anato. Anato seed, right? Yeah, nice. Do you have an anato seed here now? Ah, <laughs> this one can't go wrong with it. This is the palabok. The palabok. Have you had palabok before? I've had it from Jollibee's. I think this is going to be a little bit better. <laughs> this is a little different. So yeah, let's see how this one is. Hopefully, so good, good, good. Have you had so aside from Jollibee, have you had Filipino food before? I have. So my girlfriend Janielle, she um, is Filipino, so she I've eaten. Cooks food for you occasionally yes uh, do you think Filipino food is still underrated um, or unappreciated it's definitely underappreciated because like I hadn't really heard of it before she introduced me to a lot of it and it's all just so good besides the balut we're not gonna but talk about that it's right it's becoming now. mainstream now yes right right okay enjoy yep, appreciate <laughs> right. it yep, have a good one what makes a coffee really strong I think it's the roasting process, which is kind of different from the rest of other, you know, shops. We, um, aside from coffee beans, we also add something else. So it's not just bitter, but it, there's like a sweet note at the end. What kind of beans do you use? Um, it's Robusta coffee um, from the Philippines. Nice. Thing adds flavor to the coffee. What do you call this? Uh, we call this just a regular coffee filter, but it's not, not everyone in the Philippines doing that. Just a few old people brewing coffee like that. Notice that you have a ube flavored coffee here. Yeah, something that is uh, probably Filipino. 
<laughs> We're just joining the hype and, you know, fortunately, I think it's everyone's just, like liking it. I think it's gonna stay. Ubi's gonna stay for good. Yeah. Hopefully, yeah. Who likes the purple haze because it's pretty. It's pretty. <laughs> yeah, and it tastes like cake actually. Ah, okay. I had your coffee before and I was awake the whole night and I liked it. It was very strong. Strong but not bitter, right? Oh no, it's perfect. I, I, I really liked it. Thank you, appreciate it. I have a purple haze coffee with ube. Right. Ube. It's very... Do you like ube? I do. Yeah, it's, it's, it's very popular in the Philippines and now you have ube flavored coffee. Delicious. Right. Enjoy. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming and watching the Philippines Fest today here at uh, Fifth Avenue in Brooklyn. And I hope to see you again at Manila Avenue uh, with May 26. A, May 26. Right. Yes, May 26 with Santa Cruz. Um, that exciting. Yes, Cruz, yes, with Reina. Yeah, with Reina Elena and everything like that. And the procession with the food, with the band, with the performance. Wow. Yes, so I hope to see you there. It's from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. And uh, after that, there will be the one on Times Square, right? Yes, that Times Square is coming up soon too. But before that, we have a lot more places to go. We're going to Albany. We're going, wow. yes, in different uh, places in New York as well. So stay tuned. Please follow Philippines Fest as well. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Thanks for watching and I hope you all enjoyed this vlog. Please don't forget to hit the like button, share, comment, and subscribe. Mabuhay!